can you tell the story of the months that led up to Barry's assassination? What did, what, what, what did you know? What did you sense? What did you think? Okay, when I got out of prison, I hadn't been out long. I was uh, watch, eating breakfast, and there was Ronald Reagan's face right in the television. We have absolute proof that the communist Sandinista government is in the cocaine-running business. And there was that fat lady, the C-126, on the runway with the belly in, and I thought, oh, God, hmm. he had done it. So I had heard that Barry might have been working with him. So it wasn't long working before with... with the DEA or whoever. Yeah, he, he, he was no longer on our side, you know. So uh, can you clarify how you got that from the Reagan making a statement about we've heard? Okay, there was his plane. There was Barry's plane. And, okay, on the way north, we could stop in, in Nicaragua and land on a military base or on a, a base that they used as crop dusters and all and refuel. Yeah, And so that shortened our trip. We'd go further into the jungle and come up, and that was what Pablo Escobar and Ocho and them, and they had to, they was associates with the, the people in uh, Nicaragua. So Barry was, if that plane was there, that means Barry was feeding the DEA information. He was working with them at that time. But let me back up a little bit. When when I was flying and I told Barry we would we would refuel and change airplane, the, the loads in Belize, where I had a, a spot up there. And then that's when the, they told me we can refuel in, in uh, Nicaragua. And then you fly all the way, and Barry couldn't believe it. He says, all right, but I wanted to land. I had a place in Louisiana for $10,000 that I could land, unload, and the sheriff and all of them was paid off. And uh, he said, no, no, no. I can't get caught in Mena, Arkansas. I said, what do you mean you can't get caught in Mena, Arkansas? You get caught anywhere. He said, I can't, if it gonna, but it's going to cost you $50,000 every time my wheels touch the ground. Why? Can you explain why he can't get he caught? He said he was, he was hooked up with the, with him the very top, and he even said, I'm going to have dinner with the governor tonight. That's at that so time, Mina, Arkansas, Mr. Bill Clinton. Undoubtedly. And it's like, did Bill Clinton, did you give him any money? And I said, no, I never gave the man any money. But it was like the money that I had that went to the Grand Cayman Islands. And I told my lawyer, I said, I never touched that money. He said, you don't have to fondle it to be guilty. So, so uh, what? I mean, there's a lot of conspiracy theories and around people, the relationship between Perry Seal and the Clintons. Absolutely. What evidence do we have? What, what would you say from your best understanding um, of what was the relationship between Bill Clinton and Barry Seal? Barry said, and he knew that he couldn't get caught in Mena, Arkansas. And when that movie was going to come out, be called Mena, somebody stopped it. I mean, they stopped it dead in the tracks for two or three years, and the producer even quit. You mean the American Made with Tom Cruise movie? It wasn't. It was American. going to be called Mena? It's the name that was written and produced in Mena. And wait, waiting on Hillary to be elected, they, they would oh, not let that movie out. And that movie was changed drastically. But to push back on that, that doesn't mean there's truth there. That means they were worried about it, the power of the conspiracy theory, that's which right. stuck. Exactly. <laughs> I, mean, I don't know. <laughs> I mean, it, you know, some, some conspiracy theories, just because they're popular, doesn't mean they're true. And ones that, uh, but it also doesn't mean they're not true. And there's ones that are not very popular that could be true. But that one, that one really stuck. Do you, do you, do you, I mean, what's your sense? Well, I paid one and a half million dollars for Barry to land at Mena, Arkansas. So I was pretty well assured that he couldn't get caught. And I said, well, I can't get caught in Columbia. We can't get caught in Nicaragua. I guess we got a license. <laughs> so we went for it. Oh, so when you say I can't get caught, just to clarify, there's a, there's a sense where this is a safe place to land. Yes, like completely safe. So you don't think he was referring to some kind of, um, you know, like my grandfather who fought in World War II would talk about bullets can't hit him. So no. it's almost like no, uh, believing. He was taking that $50,000 and giving it to somebody. <laughs> to somebody. And yeah. Barry was honest, so he wasn't just taking it from me because he was making a million dollars and he didn't care for the 50000 Oh, man. 